Hello, Bill Hayes again. Well, guys, today I'm going to redo one of my uh, tests for everybody so that they can understand that the uh, draw ratio, when it's a when it is a little over three, and it's a four to one draw ratio, a three to one draw ratio, and a and a four to one draw ratio, it still gives the same effects as a five to one ratio. Okay, so I'll put this on my finger here. And we'll start with a 3 to 1 draw ratio, which is really short. <coughs> and we should only get like 150 feet per second or something out of this. Today's about a 70 degree day. All right. Now, notice what I'm doing here. I'm, I'm pulling this, putting this on this finger, into this pouch right here. And that's at the 3 to 1 draw ratio. All right. That's 159.4. What I'm gonna do is I'll just shoot uh, three shots at that. Let me zoom this in so you can see it. That's 159 .4. 162.4. Hundred and sixty two point three, and we'll do one last. Hundred sixty two point four. So about a hundred sixty two point three, it's hundred sixty two point four once the band was warmed up. Okay, now I'm gonna pull this in narrow, and we're gonna go with a one inch fork gap. This is a one foot fork gap to a one inch fork gap. Same thing on the finger. Hundred and fifty one point four. Get this done before the night falls. Hundred and fifty one point six. And hundred and fifty two point eight. We'll do one more because that one was higher. And it might be trending a touch higher. Hundred and fifty three point eight. And since that was higher than the last, we'll do even one more. Hundred and fifty two point six. All right, so it's at the hundred and fifty one to hundred and fifty three range right there with the, with the, the narrow forks. One foot to one inch. This is at the one foot mark. It is a uh, about 10 feet per second faster. Okay, and now we're going to start with, we're going to go with the 4 to 1 draw ratio. So my finger will be on this loop instead of this loop. Okay. I restarted the sensor. Hopefully it's still light enough to where we can get some good information. The uh, bands are now at about uh, 15 inches. Two hundred and thirteen point seven. Two hundred seventeen point four. Two hundred fifteen point seven. Let me see if you're zoomed in. I'm not even sure. Ah, that gummit. I'm sorry about that. Anyway, it's 215.7. 215.7. And 
and 213.3. All right, we'll do one last shot with the wide and a four to one draw ratio. All right, 209.9. Buyers are going down a little bit. So I'm gonna do one more and see if it stabilizes. It is getting a little bit cooler as the as the sun drops right now, so that can make a big difference in the in how the bands shoot. 213.8. I released that one just a hair earlier. Okay, so we're looking at uh, the 209 to 213.8 range right on on this. Okay, one inch gap from a 15 inch gap. And a four to one pull ratio. Two hundred and eight point nine. Two hundred nine yeah. and two hundred nine point five. We'll do one last one at that if the uh, if it didn't too far off. Uh, we might be losing light here, so I'm going to do another one. We'll hopefully see if it works good. All right, 207. All right, so we're looking at up to 200, uh, 209 feet per second approximately. So between 207 and 209 for the narrow, between 209 and 214 approximately for the 15 inch. So the wider is faster on a, on a three to one draw ratio and a four to one draw ratio.